I see you. Now, let's talk about England. Uh, you've had two shots at England. I heard from your agent there was Liverpool, and then recently there was Birmingham. Yes. It would be interesting to know why you didn't sign for Birmingham for a lot of persons. Ah, that one paid me, sir. <laughs> See, that, that Birmingham deal, I, my bags were already packed. Like, as I'm wow. sitting down like this, I was just sitting down waiting for my agent to call me and say, go to the airport. Wow. So, right, we did everything. Monies were agreed. Contract was sent. Everything was uh, okay. It's just for me to come to Birmingham to sign it. So, right, everything was done. How they were going to make the payment to Trap Zone and everything was okay. I spoke. Um, Harry Redknapp called me on the phone. He called me on the phone. He said to me that, Onasi, can you remember me? I said, oh, why not? Of course, I can remember you. Wow. He said, you came to Tottenham. I was supposed to sign you, but because of the problem with the work permit and all that, we couldn't sign you. So it's an opportunity for you to come and play for me now. I said, oh, he, rem he remember you from your yes, days at Tottenham? Yes, yes. Wow. He said, this is why he knows what I can do and he wants me to come and make a big change in his team because he knows what I can be able to do. So I said, I respect and I appreciate your call. For this, I was not even, I was not considering it before. But I said, for this, I'm going to honor you. So let them do everything possible so we can do that. So when everything was agreed, the next day is supposed to be the day that the FIFA ranking is going to be out. Ooh. So instead of me to travel, they said we should wait till the next day. Let the FIFA ranking come. And then the new rules came to England that I think the country must be under the first uh, 50. 50, 50 or so. Formerly, it was 100. Yes, now first 50. Because for my national team cap, I'm already okay. Yes, I know. So of course, the only thing was the FIFA ranking. We came, the result came out the next day, Nigeria was 51. <laughs> ah. What bro, is doing? Bro, like, see, I already said goodbye to my teammates. I took my football shoes. Say goodbye to the coach. In Lazio, in Trabzon. In Trabzon. Okay, yeah. Oh, wow. He's in Trabzon. And I said to the coach, goodbye. Uh, he said, I wish you well. Everything, blah, blah, blah. My agent come, he said, see what's in the apple. Oh, God. Mm. I said, it's well. I pack my boots, go back to the training ground. And the coach said, what happened? I said, said everybody was like... Wow. So, you know, when you want to make a transfer and it didn't work out, it's just like you are going to start from starting again. Your heart left from those problems. My heart, my heart left. Your not soul, like, everything. Not like left, everything, you know. <laughs> but when I came back, of course, the coach will not want to go and play, play you when you just, your mind is not even there. <laughs> the coach had to wait for like, Two, two to three weeks before he started playing me. Mm. Because you needed to to, re, to, re, to, to to basically come back. My spirit, was, my spirit was in England, so they didn't need to take a flight and come back. Yeah. 